Hi and welcome to Massage Secrets. Uh, today I want to talk about proper draping. Uh, I found it uh, very interesting that uh, some of my videos uh, had comments from people about the, you know, what, what lousy job I did on the draping. Um, you know, I'm surprised that people are not more concerned about the techniques, more concerned actually about the draping. But um, I acknowledge that there is uh, that draping is important, but I also do see that there is not just one way of draping. So I want to talk here about the principles of draping. What you need to understand. What you you need to know. What you want to achieve with the draping. So first of all. You want to make it so that it's comfortable uh, for the client, which means the sheets or towels cannot bunch up and uh, leave pressure points. Um, then the second thing is that it has to keep the uh, client warm, which means if you um, work on a certain area and you have to expose an area that you're not working on at the same time, then that kind of defeats the purpose of uh, proper draping. And then for the massage therapist, uh, you also need to consider that you have to be able to access all um, all the areas that you want to work on without changing the draping too much and also without uh, exposing areas that you're not working on. If you want to see more um, about uh, draping techniques and uh, about uh, basic massage techniques, please go to freemassagevideos.com and watch some videos about massage there.